Hi guys, Steve Girardi here. Welcome to Steve Strings. I have another unboxing video for you today. This is an ukulele which was sent to me by, uh, by K-Mice through Amazon. And this shipped from, let's see, their Hebron, Kentucky shipping facility. So without further ado, let's go ahead and open this thing up and see what it is. Okay, so from the look of this, this is a concert scale ukulele. And I like that they have a box within a box, which keeps it nice and sturdy. And you can see it comes in the, the typical K-Mice gig bag, which is sort of a black, sort of a uh, Kodoro or canvas kind of material with two straps, which I like. A small pocket on the front. And in here with this gig bag and ukulele comes some little goodies here. Um, interestingly, this has a little cloth for wiping the instrument. It says Aklot. Uh, if I understand it, K-Mice and Aklot are basically linked or the same company. It has a Joyo tuner. It has this little finger shaker you put on to kind of uh, give you some accompanying rhythm. It also comes with some uh, extra strings. And that looks like it. Um, oh, it also has, looks like a little uh, pick carrier. You can basically attach this to the ukulele and stick your picks in there. And I don't see any picks in this instrument, but those are some nice little goodies. And again, it comes with a typical sort of uh, protective wrapping on it, which I'm glad for. And oh, this is, oh, this is nice. This has a sort of a classical guitar style uh, headstock on it. There you go. It looks like it has a spruce top. And sort of this looks like a black wood back and sides. That is nice. <laughs> that is really pretty. Well, let's go ahead again. This is an unboxing video, so let's give you a quick rundown. Uh, again, from looking at this, like I said, this has a classical guitar type of head, slotted headstock with a nice dark veneer. And again, I believe this is a uh, blackwood veneer. And it has these uh, really pretty tuners. I've seen these on other instruments and they're typically pretty smooth, easy tuners. Um, I think this comes with a bone nut and saddle. And I should say that the saddle here is compensated. And the saddle looks like that may be either ebony or rosewood. My guess is rosewood. I'll check their nomenclature and uh, put it above here. It looks like it does have a uh, uh, binding on the fretboard with the little whale position marker at the 12th fret and these starfish at the other frets. And I can feel the frets a little bit. I wouldn't call them sharp, but I can feel them a little bit there. It does also come with strap buttons. As you can see, and again, this is acoustic, uh, solid spruce top. This also has some nice black trim around the side with some white purfling next to it. And then it has more of this sort of abalone uh, sort of trim with uh, looks like uh, black and white purfling on that. And the rosette around the sound hole has the same type of abalone and black and white purfling. And I should say this is really quite striking. Again, from inside you can see the K-Mice label. Again, this is the K-Mice uh, model MI2067. As I'm looking this over, I'm looking for any kinds of sort of finish imperfections, any scratches or dings or pooling, and I do not see any. Again, this is described as a solid spruce top, um, laminate uh, back and sides. And again, this is this black wood. And it's really quite nice. Here's the back of it. I'm sure you can see that in the light. So that looks like it's sort of a, a book match kind of feel to that from that, the, uh, the laminate. And again, this front here is just really, really pretty. Some folks think spruce is kind of plain, and that was my original thought to it. Um, but it usually has a typically nice sound that's kind of 
makes up for the sort of plainness of looks. But this trim around here really highlights that and makes us look really quite nice. So let me go ahead and bring this up to pitch and uh, we'll get initial sound sample. Okay guys, I brought this instrument up to pitch. Let me go ahead and give you a little chord progression so you can see what it sounds like. There you go. So the sound here. has a nice bright sound. Again, the strings are obviously still stretching. Again, from looking at this here, I mean, again, it's nicely built. Again, this is a first uh, sort of first impressions video and unboxing, but first impressions are pretty positive. I guess it has a really classy headstock on it. Beautiful trim, nice sort of, you know, figured wood or colored wood, and uh, it's just pretty. So uh, be watching out. I'll keep this for a couple weeks or so and play around with it, kind of get used to it, let the string settle, and I'll come back and do a review video. So be watching for that. Until then, thanks for watching.